everybody, Brad Karens here from Skolbeck Machinery. We are getting a ton of questions when it comes to Cosmo or Sanding Robot. So what we're gonna do, instead of answering those questions one at a time as the emails come in, we're gonna make a video series answering each question in an individual video. So today's question comes from Chicago, Illinois, and this, I mean, we get this one a million times, and the question is, how fast can it sand? Now, um, if you're new to robotic sanding, the answer is quite simple. It's as fast as you want it to sand or as slow as you want it to sand. Um, but we'll get into a quick demo and I'll kind of just run you through what it looks like sanding slow, what it looks like sanding fast. The real question that needs to be answered is how long does it take you to sand currently? Um, and that's going to help you justify whether or not this machine is the right purchase for your factory. So. Um, I can tell you we've done time studies time and time again. Uh, I wish you could see around me. I'm just surrounded in doors. This is, this is what we do. This is what we sand. So generally speaking, if you ask someone, how long does it take you to sand a door? They'll tell you two minutes. And then if you stand there and time them, it'll probably take them six. And then if you put 30 doors in front of them and walk away and come back when those 30 doors are done, you're probably going to be in the you know, six to 12 minute range per door. And generally speaking, when you're sanding with Cosmo, of course it depends on your finish, the, the coating thickness, the grit of sandpaper you're using, the white wood prep, there's a lot of factors, but generally speaking, you can be sanding a door from start to finish, front, back, edges, everything, somewhere between two minutes and 30 seconds and, and four minutes and 30 seconds. Um, so let's get started. I'll just show you the demo. We'll run it slow, then we'll run it fast. And we'll Start go by that. showing you how easy it is to uh, slow everything down. It's it's pretty simple. Everything's just a touch screen. And so, you know, let's let's slow it right down. All you do is type in your your numbers, and that's for the rail style. Then you type in the one for the X and then the Y, and we control all the patterns individually because sometimes it is advantageous to speed up some and slow down others. Oop, not that slow. Okay, um, and then so here's our rail style, here's our center panel sanding, and then here's our edge sanding. So now we've slowed down the machine, it's that simple. We just tell it what we wanna sand, and hit go. Now making it go is as simple as hitting the palm in button and then off we go. Like always, it's measuring everything there is to do about this door, the rail width, the panel width, the slope depth, the panel depth, and off it goes. So you can see, this is a little bit painful to watch, but I mean, yeah, it can go slower if you want it to go slower. It depends on what you're sanding. We'll let this one just run, um, and I guess we'll know how long it took by how long the video is. So once it's done the rail style, it moves into doing the panel. So we do one pass, the first pass around the perimeter, and you can get as close to that edge as you want. The second pass goes lengthwise, and the third pass will come this way, and the fourth pass will do circle to get rid of any uh, track time. Now 
to speed it up to something crazy, and uh, I mean, it's pretty cool to watch. Come back over here to our HMI, and we just want to change that to maybe 500. That's it. We go back to our main screen and we're ready to go. Now again. we just go back to our palm in and off it'll go. watching the timer on this one and it looks like it's going to be uh, just under a minute, 59 seconds to sand that door. So we can see that, I mean, the crazy thing for us woodworkers is, is robots are kind of new. Uh, we don't have them a lot in our shops. So, you know, when we're talking about speed in particular, you know, we tend to equate that to throughput. You know, if someone says it's faster, we're going to make more parts. So this machine, the beauty of the speed is not necessarily how fast it can go, which obviously you just saw it go crazy fast. It's that you can dial it in to your exact specification. Try and ask a sanding operator, oh, hey, the sanding was okay, but can you please go two millimeters a second faster? Uh, I mean, we, we just can't as people. But when you have the robot, you just keep going faster, 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 and watch the speed go up and up and up and up until the quality gets to a point where you're like, oh, maybe we shouldn't go so fast. And you slow it down just a little bit and you stay there forever. And that's the beauty of having a uh, robotic sanding equipment. I mean, it's, uh, yeah, it's pretty awesome. So I hope that answers the question on how fast does it go? You had to watch a video for seven minutes to hear me say it goes exactly as fast as you want it to. Now, don't forget to subscribe to the channel because every time we answer a question, you'll get notified. Also, we've got a couple of other pretty cool machines coming out in the next little while, so you don't want to miss anything. Thanks for watching.